Hello and Merry Christmas, everyone. Yes, I always pronounce the T in Christmas because I like pronouncing words exactly how they're spelled. Silent letters are dumb because letters shouldn't be silent. All letters should have a sound. All right, anyways, we're going to actually talk about Cardano stablecoin, Dejed, which I think is kind of a dumb name. But anyways, the Charles Hutchinson, the faithful leader of Cardano, has actually had some Dejed updates. So you can see his on uh, Cody's Twitter because Cody is the one implementing Dejed. And that's another reason why you should be bullish on Cody because they're the one actually implementing Cardano's stablecoin. So basically, as we are getting closer to the launch of Dejed, the Dejed stablecoin, we are pleased to share some updates on the development and progress of the current Dejed Plutus Im implementation and next milestone. So we go to the um, basically Medium, which is codynetwork.medium.com, the official site. So we are getting closer to the launch of Dejed stablecoin. We are pleased to share some updates on the development and progress. The main contracts for providing Oracle exchange rates for submitting multiple users simultaneously, for canceling pending orders, and for minting redeeming stablecoins, reserved coins have been implemented. So all that stuff's already been done. Testing is underway to ensure expected behavior. So like you basically already have the smart contracts for Oracle exchange rates, for submitting multiple orders simultaneously, and for canceling pending orders for minting redeeming stable coins. The next mile coin is a pre-released version will be delivered in a few days for UI integration. This pre-release version will provide endpoints for querying the stablecoin bank reserve, which is the current ADA in reserve, current reserve ratio, number of stablecoins, and reserve coins in circulation, querying buying and selling prices for stablecoins, reserve coins, and querying list of pending orders, submitting orders, and canceling pending orders. So implementation of configuration management and contact responsible for version control and uh, contract upgrades. Stay tuned as we continue to update you about the developmental progress. So there's a lot of stuff going on of, in terms of uh, the stable coins, uh, order books like buying, selling, pending. And obviously, like stable coins will make for better uh, yield farming and make for better um, DeFi as well. So they're really getting to the nuts and bolts of the DeFi stuff on Cardano as we wait for a lot of these swaps to actually launch. They'll probably coordinate some of this actually together. And also they're building the bank reserve for the stable coin. A pre-release version will be in the next few days. I don't really know if users can actually get their hands on it to like see what it does or like test it or anything. But I'm going to guess like with Cardano's like testing uh, time schedule, it'll probably take a month or so at least for this to go from like pre-release version and UI to like full integration. But it is getting very, very close. You can see the Cardano ecosystem coming together. Um, the Jed has actually been talked about since maybe like a month and a half, two months ago. I originally thought it was Ergo, but I think Cody took it over and now they're doing the Jed on Cardano. So that's pretty cool. Um, there's going to be a lot of, there's going to be a lot more updates soon. So you need to stay tuned for progress. And, um, I do think it'll probably come out, I would say late January, early February, like a lot of the other Cardano projects. So you can see the Cardano ecosystem taking shape. It's not like people are abandoning Cardano. Um, they're actually just waiting for apps to come out. I think apps can basically come out at any time now and Moosely Swap is kind of like uh, proof of that. And yeah, with Dejed, uh, and, uh, with Dejed updates, um, basically just follow Cody's uh, Medium. And also Charles Hodgson will probably tweet some of it sometime sooner or later. I am very bullish about Cardano on this. I think like once Dejed gets released and a lot of the stablecoin stuff gets released, uh, I do believe the ecosystem as a whole will actually come together and we'll have DeFi and sta more DeFi and staking options on Cardano. And that's when Cardano will really blow up. Um, I also think like that's around the time when Bitcoin will keep going up. So Cardano, five to ten dollars is definitely possible because like at that point, people won't be able to say it's a ghost chain or anything. There will actually be stuff on it. There will actually be active usage like most other chains with TBL and uh, you know, DeFi, actual DeFi staking. Like I said, it's not really a ghost chain right now because there is a swap on it, and it and, but it does see like very little use. So there's not too many uh, apps actually using it now, but there is actually a DeFi uh, DEX on Cardano, but it does not yet have yield farming or any of those things. We are still waiting for the implementation of those features. Plus that exchange Moosey swap, I don't know if it's like legit or not. Uh, I haven't had any problems with it because I haven't really used it. And I'm not really sure if anyone else has actually used it either. But yeah, it's cool to see Cardano coming together. It's cool to see updates from Cody. And this makes me more bullish both for Cody and the Cardano project overall. So cool, Jed stablecoin, something to keep your eye on. 
and definitely something that will help the Cardano ecosystem in the future. So that's the news for today. Let me know what you think. Like and subscribe and hit that bell notifications button. Thank you and have a nice day.